Oh, the lighting. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it, but it's happening. All right. Hi, humans on the internet. Hello, world. This is my first time making a video in my new space. I thought that this would be really interesting to show because I love watching like room tours and things. Um, but this is not your regular room tour. I'm now out in the shed, which is a room my mum renovated a while ago for my brother. She offered it to me at first, but I said I was too scared to be out here. But um, since then, things have changed. Now I'm, I'm older. I am a bit older than my brothers, and we thought it would be a good idea to swap rooms. So I have put a lot of hard work into this space not only my room but the other half of the shed i really wanted that space to be a space where everyone can sort of use it it's used as storage um like a most sheds are i've turned it into a bit of a man cave slash um gym and everyone in my family can use it so i really want to show you guys this is obviously a huge sneak peek and a majority of my room right behind me what is actually behind the camera is my favorite part of my room I am super lucky to be in the situation that I'm in. I just wanted to point that out that I am so grateful to be out in this shed. My mom has really done so much for me. Being out in this space has given me the freedom I was really craving. Um, I've, I've been talking a lot about moving out of home and now I feel really a lot more calm and I oddly enough I feel a lot of independence out here and I feel like I've kind of moved out of home in a way so I'm quite comfortable to stay here now until I've um, paid off my loan and things and then I'll be moving out with Daniel oh oh hello Daniel might actually be moving in here with me um, eventually if he feels like it because he would be able to save a lot more money living here the rent would be less for him. Quick little update, um, why I'm so grateful to be out here is because I'm actually going on two overseas trips. One of my really good friends that I met through dance um, moved to New Zealand and she's getting married and I'm so excited to go there. I'm going with my best friend Claire and my beautiful dance teacher and she's actually how I met this my friend that's getting married and it's just so special um so we're gonna go over for four or five days and celebrate her wedding and be there for that which i'm so excited for but then a week after i get home i'm going to bali with my mum Annie lisa and my best friend daniel and i've also just brought a bunch of furniture and i brought that through a loan so yeah money is a lot at the moment not that any of it's like stress <laughs> It's just, yeah, I'm living my best life and I'm also getting prepared for my future by purchasing a lot of furniture and things. Yeah, I'm just really, really happy and grateful and excited about the next few months. And I got to go furniture shopping, which is like my favorite thing in the world. So yeah, and I will begin the tour now. This is my tattoo, by the way. It's all nice and healed up now. So, oh, I love it. I won't show off the yard for safety reasons, <laughs> but this is the big green blob and enter the first thing you see when you walk in is all of my essentials sorry the lighting is really like dull in here so the first thing you see is all of the storage which is all of my essentials um i brought this beautiful tv cabinet just today and i freaking love it um i've got my couch back there and my fridge is in amongst there you can see it's samsung i actually did an essentials um tour haul there we go i did a haul of all of my essentials if you're interested in seeing that i'll link it below but that's just all of the storage stuff um and then yeah so then coming just through here this is just some flooring for the gym area um so yeah we've got a boxing bag we've got some weights and a box full of just gym stuff and yeah it's it's actually a really decently sized space and it's enough to train in for one person anyway so i'm really really happy with what i've done with this space and over night time i just bring the dog beds down and the dog sleep in here and then i've just got a nice little sink set up over here um yeah it really comes in handy i just brush my teeth out here of a morning daniel does too when he's here got some carps oh, some small bevies i think the mini alcohols are so cute that's why i've got them there i'm really lame i know um so i've just got some like nice cups you can have a glass of water when we work out got the necessities dishwashing liquid toothpaste um cute little mat here so i will show off this 
Let's see if I can be um, Mr. Kate. Probably not. Yeah, I've set up like a little man cave section for my brother and all of his tools and things because he gave up such a big space um, when we swap rooms so I thought I wanted to have this little section here for him for sure I think it's a really cute little man cave section Get onto my room the mirror on the back of my door is broken and it's a bit grubby but anyway let's ugh, get in I have some Christmas decorations up because I couldn't I thought there was no point packing them away seeing as we're nearly at um, it's nearly Christmas time anyway so that's my big beautiful bow love her and we enter straight away the first thing you see when you walk in is the big fireplace and yes I can light a fire I tried the other day and mum actually really regrets putting it in here she feels as though she spends the same amount on wood as she would have with the heat bumps and if Daniel moved in I've spoken to mum about if we could remove it so I could have more space for drawers for him um, and she didn't seem opposed to it and we could probably sell it so yeah Anyway, so as soon as you enter, I first up, first up I have my desk, which I brought up Office Works. How much was it? It was like only 130 bucks or something. Oh my gosh, it took Daniel so long to assemble it, but I like, I'm so grateful he did it because I could not have. Um, I have, I brought this beautiful chair, beautiful velvet chair from the importer. Um, and I spray painted the legs gold. It's like a full on DIY queen. I love the outcome. Um, yeah, so not too much to see here, just my working and creating space. And in my drawers on my desk, uh, in this one I just have all of my products. And in this one has a random selection of things. Um, I've got my Jeffree Star mirror, my file cabinet, <laughs> my camera. I'm actually working as a Santa photographer for two different companies this year, which is so exciting. So I went and brought some cute antlers and like little Christmas earrings. And that's like honestly one of the funnest parts is getting to dress up every time I go to a shift. <laughs> To my favorite part of my room and it's not because it's a mirror and I get to look at myself <laughs> it's yeah I freaking love the outcome of this mirror oh those hips don't lie girl so I yeah I got some fake leaves and some fairy lights and um, oh, I tried to clean the mirror and I did a oh, oh no I did a really bad job of it from here you can't really t oh you can tell oh dear anyway that's my mirror I really freaking love it and I love the Polaroids and then I've just got my shoes, my makeup case and a little office bin. Uh, the office bin matches my laundry basket so that's cool. And then I just have a shelf here with my books and my lens bowl. Part of the room just kind of speaks for itself please focus it's quite plain um, I figured that my mirror was quite hectic with all the flowers and things so I wanted this room to be this side of the room to be a bit more like um, chill so I've just got my beautiful mirror there that my friend made for me she had a little business where she was making them I'm not sure if she is anymore and the walls are still a bit grubby I need to scrub them um, I just have some more Polaroids uh, right above my bed and I've been laying on my bed this afternoon if you can't tell and over here I just have a little side table from Ishka and I absolutely love this these candles are from Bali yes there's a hole in the wall there I did not do that yeah these candles were from a market in Bali separate markets actually I was so stoked when I found them just over here we just have my clothes rack with a good little dream catcher there I actually love the look of clothes racks if they're not like messy 
Um, and then I just have my bag and purse, TV, or oh, hi, and just some more little Christmas decorations because I'm obsessed. This was the first year I was ever a Santa photographer and Skylar was so excited. Right beside my door I have this thing. I don't know what they're called. Um, just with my suitcase and laundry bin. Yeah, that is my room tour, guys. Um, I'm actually going to get a new bed. Daniel and I are going to go halves in it because we want a king-size bed. He's really, really tall and I'm quite thick. So <laughs> so a, a really big bed we would benefit from. <coughs> and I, I want like a really nice wooden one. I think it would look really nice in the space. We I'm just feeling really content and happy at the moment, guys. Um, I love my new space. I'm really grateful to be in it. I've already said that. And if Daniel was to move in here, I think it would be so nice for us to practice living together because it's obviously a huge thing for couples. And we've also been together for three years, so I do feel like we're ready. If you enjoyed watching this video, um, thank you. I'm going to try and post a lot more frequently. I really enjoy uploading, but I do have three jobs starting in two weeks. Um, so I probably won't be uploading much. But anyway, guys, I'm aware I've just finished up the vlog and the lighting is appalling in here because it's, because it's like, it's it's pretty, but it's, it's really shitty. I want to point out something quickly. And that is that I have been growing a plant and it's working. Look at this. She's flourishing. She is living her best life. Also, I want to quickly show you my Christmas setup. Yes, I've set my Christmas stuff up. Ooh, Amber. I've set my Christmas stuff up really early, but it's because I want to get all my shopping done before the end of November. I already showed you that. I have these, and I've had to, that's the fire going. It's like a really nice vibe in here when the fire's going. I've moved my clothes rack here so that I can have my Christmas stuff. The Christmas tree is up. Look at her. She's beautiful. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, the next video I'm going to upload is going to be um, can fully licensed drivers of like 11 or so years pass their L1s test. I've been working on this for a little while and I think it's a really cool concept. So look forward to that. Thank you for supporting my channel and I will see you in the next one. Bye.